How's it going, folks? It's been a few days, hasn't it? Just wanted to check in with y'all, see how you guys are doing. I've been watching y'all's videos. Robert Man Piper. Mel Harris using those nine mils. Do what you gotta do, brother. Haven't seen old Ghost Cobb in a minute. Maybe he'll maybe we'll get a fine five for Friday. Join this corn cob country gentleman in it. I got a fairly new blend to me, at least. Pick this up. Mm. Was it last Saturday or the Saturday before? Probably two Saturdays ago. It's the Dunhill. Peterson Blends, Royal Yacht. I'm liking it. Um, probably the best out of all the Dunhills. Didn't really care for nightcap. Early morning pipe was okay. Standard mixture's okay. Three year matured Virginia's okay. Haven't tried Elizabethan, haven't tried Flake. To me, their blends are just okay. You know, nothing to write home about, but I really like this. I could see myself stocking up on some of this. Tobacco pipes. I mean, sorry, tobaccoreviews.com has it classified as an aromatic, but I, I don't think so. It says a unique smoking experience created by the beautiful blend of yellow and bronze Virginia. So it has a couple different Virginias. It does have some type of topping. I'm not sure. It smells like a plum topping or something but I really don't know. It doesn't come through in the taste too much, like a raisiny plum topping, but I, I smell more of the Virginias than I do any type of topping. And the Nick Hit is quite strong. I mean, it's not like you know, lay your back strong, but that's originally why I wanted to try it because I heard, uh, saw a few reviews on it and, um, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a smooth tobacco. The retro hell is real smooth, a lot smoother than that Cornell deal, um, Carolina red flake, the small batch that came out about a month or so ago. I liked it at first, but the more I smoke it, it's harsh, man. It's just way too harsh, especially on the retro hell. It's almost like smoking a cigarette. Oh, we got someone coming up here. What's going on? Abby's being mean. Lily's being mean? Yes. Why are you being mean to your little sister? Sorry, folks. What did you say? 
Why are you being mean to your sister? Well, remember what I told you. You guys are being mean to each other. You're going to get punished when you come back inside. All right, put your hood on and go play. They won't be mean to you anymore. No, they won't. I'll spank them. Hey, guys, I'm trying to do a video. Can you please save it for another time? Life is a stay-at-home dad. Got my cup of joe. <sighs> Temperature is a little chilly out right now. It's say in the 40s. It's not too bad, but still a little chilly. But anyway, back to this royal yacht. I can see myself stocking up on it. It has a good neck hit. Very smooth though. Um, not harsh at all. Like the Carolina Red Flake is. Now I'm stuck with a bunch of tins of that stuff. Oh well. If any of y'all like it, want to trade, let me know. I've been smoking those McClellan Virginias and really there's nothing like it. So anyway, I hope y'all having a good week. Huh? Hey, you need to put your jacket on. Okay. I just picked up the kids from school. Went by Lowe's. Got some charcoal for dinner tonight. Gonna throw some salmon on the grill. Kids are excited about that. <laughs> I'm gonna play my jacket. Hey, Illy, put her jacket on. <laughs> Come on, go. Let Sissy put your jacket on. No. Eliana, the oldest one right there, she's she just made the school news team. She's the weather girl. As some of y'all know, she does have a her own YouTube weather channel. It's called Teeny Bopper Doppler. Go check her out, sub her. She needs to put out more content. She was doing videos on a the regular there, but stopped for a while when she started school. Now she's on the, now she's the school weather girl. And they do recordings every day and show them to the school body in the morning. Yep, you got chips. You want me to open them? Yeah. There you go. Okay, go. Goodbye. Well, don't have much else to talk about. Just wanted to check in with you guys. Say a prayer for my brother. He just, uh, he lives in Virginia, right outside of DC. He's having to go into surgery here in a little bit. He had to go to the emergency room earlier this morning. Has a, something blocking his, in his bowels won't come out so they're saying he's gonna have to go into surgery here in a little bit he'll be all right though but i'll just say a quick prayer for him if you don't mind his name's calvin
So anyway, I'm gonna let y'all go. I'm gonna finish up this pipe, finish this coffee. And cook some dinner here in a little bit. Fire up the grill. Throw that salmon on there. We'll check in with you on Friday for Good News Friday. Until then, y'all keep it smoky.